Yeah, let's explore this mansion, I, huh? This place would make an incredible film location. Oh, yeah. Ooh, who's this guy? I love your outfit, by the way. Oh. Huh. Well, thanks. Now well, that was a curious sound. Well, the shoes are Italian. Oh, that door oh. opened. Okay, before we enter that door, I'm just gonna... He's got a guy who's got a pants guy. See other so things. These pants from his guy's guy had him tailored just right by the other guy I know who also got me the blazer, which is like a super limited VIP club edition. <laughs> but you want to know a secret? Sure. Found the turtleneck in a second hand shop. Scandalous. Right? Nothing uh, here. Hi, Ray. Good morning. Welcome no, no. back. Elma, oh, welcome back. Be sure of that. Give me a second, guys. Okay. Should I go upstairs first or there? I'll go there. From the creators of Dead by Daylight. Ah, yes. Let's check out the other floors. Good thinking. Wait. H hold on a second. What? Before all this goes any further, I need to know how both of you got your pieces of the film. Yes, sir. Um, well, it's no secret, really. Um, your mom? After my mom died a few months ago, I, I guessed it. found it when I was going through her stuff. Maddie, what was your mom's name? Both or was it Bonnie Rivera? Yeah, it. Oh. How did you know that? Oh 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 oh. You look just like her. Did you know my mom? She was friend. A long time ago, a whole other lifetime. Her younger brother Jaime was one of my closest friends. Hi, Nicole. Jaime, I am. Um, I never met him. I hadn't heard that Bonnie had passed. Okay, yeah, so it Brother was Jaime. Pretty sudden. Wow. Daddy, that's it's quite sad. Very touching. Hi Gary. How's Frank Stone doing? Doing good. I like this game. It's a bit different from other super massive games we have played. It's not really like all jump scares and a lot of quick time events. It has a solid story right now. So we are following that. This is the full game. Hi, Red. Hey, Elma. Hey, Shan. Come on in. What about you, Sam? Stan? How did you get your film? And what about you, Stan? Where'd you get your piece of the film? Well, now, that is a very good question. Mm. Hi, Henry. James, welcome back. And an expensive one, too. Mm. But you know what? Since I am such a big fan of your work, I'll give you a little taste, free of charge. I can't tell you who I got it from or why they had it. Mm -hmm. I will tell you that I acquired it from them completely by the book in a very honorable game of chance. You won it? Fair and square. Who the fuck would be gambling with it? They have no right. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> well, it seems like you're more attached to this little project than what you've been letting on. You don't just gamble away something like that. All right, so one door opened here. I want to check that first before we enter another cutscene. Okay. So far, I like Linda, and in the past lifetime, I liked uh, Robert, was it? Yeah, that guy. I like two characters so far from all these. What is that? Dun tuner, regulator. Yeah, they're trying to bring back Frank Stone, right? That's the whole plan with this. Augustine has interest in temporal machinery. Like temporal time travel? Something like that? Looks like practically every room in the house. Uh-huh. Do we see anything weird? Where's our host? Must be in the no signal room, right? Hi, Damien, you're the old lady, yeah. I am old and smart. Okay, so we can only go up right now. I can't interact with that for some reason. There's nothing there. Oh, we can run. That's better. Hey, Daniel. Welcome back. All right, what's going on here? What's this? Cool statue. 
Intriguing, right? Hmm, missing a piece, though. What is it missing? Hi, Crims. What is it missing, guys? Wow. Powerful resemblance in our... Whoa. What is that? Quite a piece. Look at the metalwork. It's beautiful. Elevator? Uh, looks like... Secret room? Not so secret, but yeah. The face of evil. Sensationalist trash. Sam Green took down Frank Stone. I could write a better book than this. Lovely. There were suspicious suspicions that Frank Stone committed his crimes. Yeah. Yeah? Now what would you do if it was you here instead of me? Shaped like the hillbilly? <sighs> no way. You'd be climbing the walls looking for a way out. So we have three it's trinkets. Stamped? We need nine more guys. Shh, not okay. in a million years. No way. We will know. You sure would get a kick out of this place? And then you'd probably kick me out of this place and keep it all to yourself. Who are you talking to? Mm, uh, no, I, I wasn't. I could hear you. I was talking to my mom. To Bonnie. I've just felt so, like, empty since she died. Like I'm sleepwalking through a nightmare and I just can't seem to wake up. Oh yeah, we see that. We saw that nightmare. It never gets easier when you lose someone. But it does become less suffocating. I hope so, because sometimes I just feel like I'm going crazy. Like, she really is out there, guiding me, trying to tell me something. That's why I came here. It felt like that's what she wanted me to do. I know you said it had been a really long time, but can you tell me anything about her from when you knew her? Ah, uh, gosh. Well, she was the most intimidating girl I've ever met. Even after I got to know her. She did everything she wanted to do and nobody could stop her. <laughs> and that sounds like mom. Any good stories? Uh, there's something I never told anyone else. I would like to know that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there is something I've been thinking about. I've never told anyone else. Mm -hmm. It was a long time ago. Let's hear it. We were just kids making a movie. Jaime, Chris and me. Everything's still so fuzzy about what happened, but there's one thing that always just stuck in my mind. Clear as a bell. That night, uh -huh. we were on our way home from picking up a new camera. Yeah? We were driving past the Rivera's house. The garage door was wide open, full of light. And the craziest fucking sound you ever heard was just tearing out of there That's in every direction. And right in the middle of it all was Bonnie. I, I don't think I've ever seen anyone so completely in tune with themselves. The only thing that mattered was that moment. Nothing else. What that is? That was your mom. Interesting. Thank you. Hi, Aziz. Maddie is hey. grateful to hear hey, the memory. Look. What, what is it? I don't see anything. Ah, there. Right yeah. there. Yeah, I oh saw God, it. There's someone out there. I saw it. Uh, they might be after the film strips. If the plot gets any thicker, Augustine expected something like this. They might be after the film strips. 
If someone else did find out this deal is going down, they might be after the film strips. Well, healthy competition does make for better offers. My guess is that if they're all dressed in black and prowling around the place like a thief, they're not here to make an offer. Maybe they just want to make a dramatic entrance. Should we tell Augustine? They might be dangerous. Even if you wanted to tell her, good luck finding her. She said she was going to her private reliquary. That's a place for artifacts, right? There's artifacts all over the place. Right. So, if you were gonna have a private place for extra special, extra valuable artifacts, maybe you'd put them behind a door like that. Exactly. You've got a point. Can't we just knock? I doubt anything can get through that, including sound. Which means it might be the safest place to be, whether Augustine's in there or not. So okay. how do we get in? Oh, who's that? Is that Robert? It could be Robert. Oh, we're in the past now, I think. Yes. This is where we make the film. Yeah, 1980. The Phantom of Siddhar Steel. What's taking them so long? This is the old Nilda, Linda. We're going to a production meeting before we shoot. Fans are already all loaded up. I read an article that said girls don't like it when guys get all twisted up about their punctuality. They find it controlling. What? Why did you need an article to tell you that? I just thought you might find that information useful. I'm not trying to control Chris. Just got a lot to do. Uh huh. Right on time. Right at time. Time to get cooking. Ooh. He's jealous. What? Nothing, nothing. Just trying to keep a low profile. Bonnie's snooping around. All right. Is everybody ready to get this production meeting started? We got a big night ahead of us. Guys, I, I gotta tell you, my mind's going like a million miles an hour right now. Did you know you can get, like, every newspaper article ever written at the library? It's insane! It's all right there! No, tell me more. I I've spent, like, all day looking up every single thing I could find about Frank Stone, the mill, the murders. We are sitting on a freaking gold mine here. Sounds like a productive day. I can't take all the credit. I had a little help from my, uh, <sighs> assistant. It was nothing. Hey, modesty free zone. I think I would have given up about eight dozen times if this guy hadn't been there to cheer me on. Just doing my job. <laughs> He's jealous. Oh, that reminds me. Now that you are an official member of the team, gotta wear the team jersey. <laughs> wow. This is, <laughs> this is amazing. I'm, I'm honored. You wanna wear the stripes? You gotta earn the rights. I promise I'll be the best ancillary producer you've ever seen. <laughs> Production assistant. Yeah, yeah, totally. <laughs> Feast your eyes. Whoa. Wait, where's Sheriff Green? Ah, uh, yeah, so Dad's never exactly been stoked about that. But I thought he got the guy. Yeah, and Sheriff Kushik took all the credit. Oh, yeah. People around here knew what was up, but... Let me see that. This one's a 10-year retrospective. They go into all sorts of grisly details left out of the press the first time around. And Dad got a little more credit, too. This is big deal stuff. We're making our movie in the very same spot it went down. Can't beat that. Stone's victims were real people. Yeah. Let's go with that. Stone's victims were... real people. This was a real person. Yeah? So? I don't know. It's one thing to talk about it. It's another thing to look at their picture. And this is suddenly now a problem for you? It's not a problem. It's just a little weird. You were just like super gung-ho when I got here. What gives, man? Nothing. I just don't want to like exploit any of the victims or whatever. We're not gonna exploit Stone's victims. I'm just trying to maximize the potential of our main location. That's how you make a good movie. 
If I'm gonna sneak you back in there, you better make it good. He gets it. You're right. Okay. Yeah, you're right. We've only got one shot at this. Yeah. So, let's not fuck it up. Can we help? Nah, Robert and I will go through and see if there's any other good places in the mill to shoot. Then we'll head out. Okay. Look around the garage, then talk to Linda. I'm sure no one was sad to see it go. Yeah, closed permanently. Our list sure can't get enough Frank Stone. Why don't you start with these? So we're looking for Frank Stone references. We're looking for anything referencing. I wonder if Linda's okay with all this Frank Stone the stuff. The mill's a pretty What's that? huge place. That's why I'm sure there's got to be something we haven't found yet. Definitely possible. We'll find it. Five chakras. Hmm. An omniverse? Far yeah. out. Look at this. Mill projections dire for fall season. It mentions Frank? No, but it goes into the mindset of the workers. People were depressed. There were suicides. At the mill? Not at the mill, but like... People who worked there or got laid off. Damn. This was a year or two before the murders started. Does yeah, this thing is everywhere. Like place. I wonder if I find them shit. all, what will there happen? There are a couple articles like this. The mill was in serious decline. But if it doesn't mention Frank... I don't know. It's all related. To him. Uh, to the way he was. Or, finally getting out. Why he yeah. did what he did. Or I can't wait. Something. That's your expert opinion? It's just a hunch. Oh, the cassette. Let's take that. I pulled some of these today too. What's let's that? let's play that. From hey, the Chetan, welcome the back. This looks like the quarry, yeah, report. because it's from the same Good developers. Thinking. This is their next big game. So far, I like it. Yeah, yeah, I can remember it clear as a bell. Don't think I've ever experienced anything like that, Mac. Before or since. This is Tom, the security guard. Will again. <laughs> Heck, I don't know if I would have even made it out alive if it weren't for Sam Green. Ooh. Man's a hero. Damn shame that no good sheriff's taking all the credit. Damn crying shame. He all but gave up on finding stone at the mill. Sam Green. Ain't it better? He came right up and told me we had to search every nook and cranny of that place. And if we had waited just a second longer, well, there'd be one less beautiful baby in the world. Or worse. I wonder who that Sam baby is. Stone down just in the nick of time. Like something out of a movie. Thanks to Mr. Holt. Nobody questioned my dad's story. Wow. They were friends after that. My dad gave the eulogy when Mr. I didn't want to say anything, but I'm just not a fan of this. Mm. Understandable. Should I be worried about Robert? I don't think so. Our obsession with Frank Stone is intense. Her whole obsession with Frank Stone and the murders just feels a little intense. Maybe it's because she's not from Cedar Hills, but you know, those victims could have been any of us or our families. But they weren't. So you don't think it matters either? I didn't say it didn't matter. I just meant it happened a long time ago. And Chris is excited because some of the locations could work really well for the film. Like this one. Take a look. What is all this? What's that? I came up with a new scene to shoot. That she wrote? Yeah. Who's Chris? I told Chris about it last night. Oh, she was into it? Yeah, we'll shoot it if we have time. Cool. How far? I'm like uh, two hours this in the game right now. This furnace chamber location is perfect. But I wouldn't have known about it without Chris's research. Oh, 
Encouraging. It's pretty rad. Hope we have time to shoot it. It's very supportive of you. Thanks, Robert. I mean, Jaime. Sorry. Forgot which one of you is the supportive one. <laughs> that was mean. You're mean. Yes. Yes, I am. Oh! Yes! Huh? What is... It's a picture of Frank Stone? Look at the date. Yeah. Oh, yeah! What? This is from before the murders, before they realized it was Frank. It's about mill operations, kind of a puff piece to drum up interest in new recruits. Hello, what is this? Look at the caption. Worker Frank Stone, machine shop. Bullseye. Machine shop, huh? We've got to shoot there. That's it. That's the place. It's perfect. Let's go. So, time to go? Okay, people, company move. Time to head on out and Finally, shoot the some shit action. out of this thing. Let's go, let's go. Time is money. Let's make a movie. Can you give a little just about the story so far? Um, it's very hard because a lot has happened and uh, the story revolves around hmm. being in the past now, and being in the future both. Ding -dongs working on? Hold on, hold on. Hello. Interesting. So this is created by the creators of dead by daylight it's about frank stone he was a ladies and gentlemen serial killer i present and the mail this started yep. with uh, there it is officer taking down frank stone you see the creek down there we follow that takes us right to the secret entrance i don't see it that's why it's secret <sighs> We don't have to do this. Yes, we do. Ready? Oh, careful. First step's a doozy. So yeah, the officer took down Frank Stone in this particular mill. And it said that his soul is still there. All right. This way. Fast forward to 2024. This film which these guys are making is cursed and parts of the films are being sold at a mansion in 2024 that's where we saw that girl Linda becomes old Linda that's what happened and this is where we are shooting the movie after Frank Stone is killed in the mill but got the killer yet they got the killer, but his soul is still there. That's that's what we saw in the cutscene yesterday. Really confusing. I I can't explain it better than that. Not much has yeah. happened right now. So don't worry. You can still follow up. This is where we're going to shoot the movie where that everything happened. Where everything happened. I can't believe we're gonna see the place where Frank Stone actually killed people. Exactly. Thank you, Chris. Okay, two ways into the storm drain from here. One easy and one hard? They're both medium difficulty. Then give us medium one first. Well, medium one is to climb the gate over there. Then it's like a straight shot right in, but it'll take us pretty close to my dad's patrol route. Ooh. And medium two? Medium two is we cross to the other side, where we're a lot further away from my dad, but it's also going to take a bit longer. Hmm. Those are both very medium. Right down the middle. So, which way? Which way should we take? Uh, I think we can climb and avoid that somehow. Let's let's take the risk, guys. Let's make it exciting. Let's keep this as simple as possible and not waste any time. Okay, okay. We just have to be careful about my dad. We will. Hop on over. Okay, hands on. Your dad really patrols the mill every single night? Ever since I can remember. Hmm. I used to think it was. There's weird, another one, guys. It's just kind of his thing. How do we get Growing that? Up, nothing killed a friendly conversation. How do we get that? Than someone calling my dad the hero of Cedar Hills. I remember he didn't want to be interviewed for that profile they ran for the 10th anniversary. Uh... I had a cool title though. 
What was the title? The Man Who Drew Blood from a Stone. Damn. I mean, it could make a good title for the other movie. Uh, other movie? Oh, here we go. That's how we get it. It's a trinket. We have to collect 12 of those and something happens. I don't know what happens. We were just batting some ideas around, just spitballing. Cool. Uh, maybe we should stick to finishing one movie Oh, we got time. six? Totally. Yeah. No, I don't think we got six. It's just this number six. Got that. Okay, so far so good. Wish we had a flashlight or something because it's really dark. He got the model mill t-shirt on. Oh uh, wait, hold on. Before we go in there, is there anything else we can do here? No. Hey Aimi. You okay, buddy? What's this way? Oh. I can go under here. Ah, there's a small lizard. Hi, John. Perfect. Okay. You good? Don't know why I decided to do that, but we are in anyways. Oh, that's, that's my dad. dad. Everybody hide. Oh, oh, dad is here. Hey, dad. He, he's really protective of this place because he's the one who took down Frank Stone. He don't want anything weird happening in there anymore. Anyone there? Getting too old for this. Just go home, man. He won't come back this way again. Let's go. Ooh, careful. Careful. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. I know what's gonna happen. Oh, nothing happened. Look at that. This place is awesome. I wonder what we'll find inside. It's actually beautiful, yeah. Let's go up. Uppity up. We're in the mill. Are you absolutely sure this is safe and we're not going to fall into some kind of ventilation shaft full of whirling fan blades? Ooh. I can't promise you won't, but at least you'll be able to see them as they tear you to pieces. Nice. <laughs> Flashlights. Oh, Brought one for everyone? Yep. What you got in there? Ah, well, the flashlights. Uh, my notebook, some pens, a couple of granola bars, three ponchos, first aid kit, bottle opener, sunscreen, collapsible cookware, and utensils. <laughs> you know we're not hiking the Appalachian Trail, right? Always be prepared. He is. Hi, Senki. Welcome back. Ooh, someone's looking at them? Ooh. Okay, we are in. We are in, guys. Let's go, Robert. Move it. Let me go. Let me go at front. We must be under the mill by now. Just gotta find a way up. Okay. Haven't you ever talked to your dad about that night? What night? The night he was here with Frank Stone. Full of adventure, yeah. yeah. 
There must be something good here. Oh, this is the same thing. Ah. Who would have left this here? The relic. Okay. What's that? Really golden. I'm coming back. Look at that. I have four of them. Need eight more. Hopefully I'll get it. Ooh, this opens. Oh, interesting. I'm not sure about Linda's new scene. Why? But if I pull the director card, she'll probably never talk to me. Huh. Well, okay. Casting shed? Yes, sir. Got an item. Better get back to Robert. Okay, hold on. Yeah. I'm not sure about Linda's new scene. Hi, Nikki. Welcome. But if I pull the director card, hope you like the stream. Probably never talk to me again. Can I use the item there? No, I have the key. Can I can I not use the item? No, okay. My bad. So where's the casting shed? What's that? Okay. Nothing. Anything back there, guys? Did you check it properly? Oh, uh, there's this this box. We came from there, okay. Um, <clears throat> so I was gonna say when I was little and he was really drunk, even though he doesn't remember, I kind of like knowing what he went through. Ooh, I got that. He didn't talk to me like a little kid. Or like my dad uh -huh. got to see him the way he really is. This he game is not out. No, it's out now. You know, he fucked up his shoulder that night. You can play the Real full game bad. now. It's out. Still can't use it like he used to. PC and PS5, Probably Xbox also. Damn. I didn't know it was so intense. He told me he and Frank Stone squared off face to face. Oh, yeah. Right here. What's the, the name? This is the casting the of Frank Stone. Actually. Oh, shit. Brand new game from what Super Massive. Can't open that. Just that. Oh, anything up here? Nope. Did I come here already? No, I don't think so. I'm just checking everything, guys. I don't want to miss anything. Okay, let's get back to Robert. Yeah, let's get back to Robert. Hmm. Interesting. As I was going to say, just that he saw things no man should ever see or know. What does that mean? Every time I've ever brought it up, gets that look in his eye and I just don't want to see him like that hmm. you sound disappointed pick up oh it's his hat Sam's hat no no But I'm glad you've got such a good relationship with your dad. Me too. Who made these markings? Anything back here? No. Uh, they're going that way, so 
This must be the side area. Let me explore this real quick. Maybe I'll find something good. Nah. Nothing. Oh, hey. What was that? What is that? Just some screws. Do you guys see something? Very strange. I think this is it. Up there. Nice. Lovely. Let's go. We are in the mill. How exciting. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, yes! Robert, you're a genius. Good call on the storm drain. Thank you, Robert. Come on, people! No more standing around flapping our yap sacks. One more scene and we're done. This is the cursed reactor. Ooh. That's where he died. The entity is coming. Uh, oh. And cut. How is that for you? I think we got it. You know what that means, right? And that's a picture wrap on Murderville. Way to go, everybody. Oh, they're done? They're done filming. hugs we still have one more scene remember uh i think we still have one more scene left to go before we're officially wrapped wait what's the last scene uh right yeah linda pitched shooting a scene that would flesh out our backstories adding a little flesh huh yeah i think we could work with that but you're playing brother and sister come on with our chemistry Nobody's gonna buy that. Where are you thinking we'd shoot the new scene? I do have a place in mind, actually. Who's watching them? Oh, yeah. That's the furnace chamber, right? Let's go in there. What do you guys think? I say we do it. Sounds good. I got no option in that. Oh, someone's watching them. Yo. You coming? Uh, yeah. Be right there. Someone's there. Did you see something? No. That was nothing. You sure? You seem kind of spooked. What's up? Nothing. <laughs> nothing, right. Except Jaime saw a ghost back there. Okay, I'm not five. I don't believe in ghosts. You will. Ah, get off me! Get off me! Get, ah, ah, get off me! Get, gotcha. Oh, it's Bonnie. Not cool, Bonnie. Disagree. Not cool. <laughs> what are you doing here? I'm part of the crew. We don't need any help. Then I'll just hang out and stay out of your way. This is a closed set. <laughs> Apparently set. not. I may. Uh, um, Bonnie. I really think you should be helping dad at home right now. You've got a lot on your plate, you know, and, uh... And that's all I'm good for? Uh, uh, no, no, no. I mean, that, uh... <clears throat> Linda? Bonnie's gonna do what Bonnie's gonna do. I get the feeling Bonnie's gonna do what Bonnie's gonna do, no matter what we say. And that's that. 
Well, okay, are we just gonna stand around or are we gonna make a movie? Time is money, right? <laughs> just make sure you don't get in the way. We've still got a lot to do and I don't work well with distractions on my set. I think you mean our set. All right, here we go. I'm Linda. Crouch. Ooh, look at that. Let's open that one also. Well, nothing in there. I wonder what's gonna happen when we collect all the trinkets. Must be something important. Or... Guys. You guys don't have to come in there. Oh, we can open that. But not, not yet. Where? Oh, in there? How do we go there? It's right there, but I don't know how to go there. Can I go around? Maybe. Oh yeah, it's in there. What happened? I can't go in there? That's sad. Stuck. Well, what if we get a crowbar or something? I do have the casting shed key. Maybe I can open that. Nah, that's still locked. Cannot do anything up here. Cannot go in there. Oh, yes. Thank you. Got it. Now we can get that trinket. Beautiful. Use item. Boom. Lovely. Uni mask. Good thing we have a crowbar now. It will be very useful. Can't open that, right? Even though I, I have the crowbar. No. Nope. That's fine. That's all we needed. Now we can progress. What are you guys doing up? Doing there? Oh. The stairs are broken, so we cannot go there. Nice. Let's get in. came face to face with Frank Stone. Yep. I always had a mental picture of it, but 
now that I'm actually seeing it with my own eyes. All right, Kinshuke, welcome know, it's back. Different. There's another trinket over here. Find a place to shoot, okay. Oh, that one's easy. Okay, that's good. Oh, maybe not that easy. How do we get there? I need a ladder or something. These guys in, are in a hurry. Look at them. But I'm Linda. Big brain Linda. I want that trinket. No matter what. Talk to Chris. That's locked. Man. I really want that trinket, man. There must be a way to get that. Maybe not now. Backstory of who Frank Stone is. Yeah, Frank Stone was a serial killer who was taken down by a police officer in the start of the game. Maybe I can take this thing and then put it back there. Last of Us style, you know. This is after those events. The mill is closed and... Right there, we can actually see the ashes, <laughs> I guess. It happened right here. So is there no way to get that trinket? I can think of one way, which is take this up, try dropping down. No, I can't drop down and I'm scared if I progress i won't be able to get that one can i save game i can't of course you cannot save game there is this thing surely not on is there a ladder i'm missing Well, oh, needs a part. Okay, so I need a part. So I can definitely come back here. Let me look for it, guys. Let me look for the part. Must be right here somewhere. Linda is smart. She can get it. Oh, what's that? Is that the part I need? Must be. Hold on, guys. Anything back here? Squeeze in there. Okay. Must be it. Item added. Beautiful. Let's go, go, go. Frank is not dead. Yeah, his, his soul is still there in the reactor. That's what we saw in the cutscene yesterday. But we don't know for sure. There's a small lizard in my room. Pet lizard. Oh, look at that. Nice. I was not going anywhere without you. Got it. I think I need six more. Alright guys, I'm done. Let's go. Are we shooting right here? Yeah, this must be it. This is the furnace after all. Hi Chris. Who do I talk to? Anyone? 
Here's what we're gonna do. Jaime, Chris, you start here. Robert and I will follow. Uh, Bonnie, j just stay behind and try not to make too much sound while we're rolling. You got it, boss. <laughs> All right. Everybody ready for a take? Lights ready. Sound speeds. Hi, Sylvia. Hi, May. Chris, all set. I really think this and camera is cursed. Action. Is there something else you want to say to me? Because now's your last chance. Yeah, as a matter of fact, there is. Don't do this. I have to. No, you don't. You know that's not true. Well, maybe I'd feel better if it were anyone else. Who else is there? But it's not fair. No one said it was. Already lost mom and dad. I don't want to lose you, too. Now who's being unfair? At least I'm not being selfish. Selfish? I'm doing this for you. I'm doing this for our parents. If I can pull this off, it might not be too late to save mom and dad. That's impossible. Nothing is impossible. Something about this just doesn't seem right. Do you trust me? I... I... Do you trust me? Yes, of course! Then you know what I have to do. <sighs> and cut! You heard that? Linda, that was sick! Totally, felt like just what this thing needed. How was the lighting? It was great, thanks. Did you hear that weird groan yeah. right at the end there? Yeah. Uh, no, but... Don't sweat it. We're going to replace the sound at Jaime's anyway. How'd I do? It was perfect. Jaime, it was perfect. Do you really think so? It was everything we needed the scene to do. You okay? Yeah. Uh, something about this just doesn't seem right. Uh, okay, that's not what I sounded like. I don't know. It was pretty spot on. Gotta agree. Gotta agree. I don't go around doing impressions of you dopes. You do impressions of me all the time. And me. I feel honored to have just joined the list. Hot damn, kids. That was fun. You really thought it was okay? Yeah, better than half the films I see in New York. I mean, one of them was just a five-hour shot of a guy sleeping. Wow. Seriously. I'm impressed. Well? But, uh, I gotta be honest. What? You really didn't think I'd notice what you were doing? Um, what was I doing? Just playing out your own bullshit interpretation of real life. I don't understand. Sacrificing your own life for the good of your sibling and your parents? I desire Definitely welcome. Definitely sounds familiar. Almost like it could even be based on someone we know, but gee, I wonder who. That's not fair, Bonnie. No one said it was. Well, we're trying to make something fun. I'm not trying to make everyone else miserable. At least I'm not being selfish. Selfish? Don't throw the lines back at me. What? You don't want to tell me how noble it is that you're making this movie with your girlfriend while I had to scrub my entire life to take care of you and dad? I liked it better when you were gone. I'm gonna get some air. Uh, I'm just gonna go get some fresh air. You should probably go too. What, like go, go? I don't think I want you here right now. So, I, I just wanted to tell you uh, how much I loved making this movie with you. Me too. I mean, with you, not with me also. <laughs> you know what I mean. I think we should do something special to mark the occasion. So, I don't know if I'm quite ready to break out the champagne just yet. But we finished the movie. It's in the can. We finished the shoot, yeah, but... We're still gonna have to sell people on this thing. Okay, sure. We should keep exploring this place while we still can. 
I don't know if that's a good idea. Well, if we can just get, like, one more shot of something directly connected to Frank Stone, like anything he might have left behind, we'll get all the attention in the world. We should look for that place from the newspaper article, the machine shop. Uh... Hey, Chris. Okay, raise the camera. Here we go. Holy... What can you see? Something freaky. Yeah. I don't know if I can describe it. I'll try shooting a little. Whoa! Ain't that something? Ah, rats. What's up? Camera needs cranking. Hold on. Okay. Reload. Huh. That did it. Okay, let me get more. <sighs> Whatever the hell that was, it's gonna look great in the movie. Interesting. Think that door will take us to the machine shop? Only one way to find out. Let's go take a look. Ashes of Frank, exactly. So this game is only missing a bit more scares, you know, because I miss those. I get it that it's a story, narration, experience, and whatever, but we need some scares, man. Not enough scares in this game. How much? We're like three hours in the game now. And only thing we saw was that mom with the hollow eyes, ah, like that. Remember? That's it. No more scary stuff. My dad would kill me if he knew I was in here right now. Just rip my limbs off one by one. I thought the sheriff was all bark and no bite. Not if you're his son. <laughs> Danny's all of both. Don't you think it's weird how obsessed with this place he is? Yeah, some chills, so. yeah. I mean, he always has been, as long as I can remember. I didn't even know it was weird until I got old enough to realize all the long walks. We all know what's better than drama, right? Night, it's drama horror. Still mill where he killed a guy. Maybe that's why he comes back right to now, the scene of the crime. This is just drama. Maybe it helps him somehow. Not much is happening. Honestly, Still, I don't even think I'm positive about help. this. What do you mean? Uh, it's it's more like an obsession. And it's gotten pretty weird. Uh, okay, elaborate on that, please. Maybe it's just the way he was dealing with all the stress of guilt. Machine whatever, shop. But so he sort of started researching. That's all where kinds we're gonna enter a cutscene. Philosophies. Non-traditional. Like acupuncture with all the pins? No. We need no. to get up there. Wait, you don't mean like all the trinket cult stuff? Look, I shouldn't have said anything. Well, there. you did. I don't want to give you guys the wrong idea. My dad's a straight shooter. That's Did he say it. cult stuff? Sure. Whatever you say, man. Hey, Chanakya. It's a narrative horror experience, just like uh, Man of Medan, Little Hope, you know, those games. I have the key. Oh my god. I'm so good at this game. Alright. Here we are, guys. So if you're missing any episodes guys i'm uploading the videos on youtube also for the full episodes part one is up okay what do i do with all this bullet i guess all right cannot oh can i get in there oh, come on Pull this one as well. Okay. And there is this one. Let me see what's going on.
Oh, okay, I see, I see. I see. Give you a room tour it's nothing in this room in front of me is the whole setup and behind you can already see it not much only a sofa that's it this is only the room in which i stream that's it the bedroom is on the left side over there behind me there's the kitchen so i can give a house tour but in the room there's nothing oh balance Oh, I don't want to die here. Oh my God. Okay, I can get the trinket now. All this for a trinket, guys. Well, I didn't even touch it. We jump. Boom. 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 All right. Five more. I'm not even touching it. What's happening there? Is that motion sensor? <laughs> okay, I want to go back because that's the ladder I took. So is there something down there? No. No, it's nothing. Anyways, I only care about the trinkets right now. Let's go down there again. Yeah, we could see future. It's like premonitions and stuff. In this game, that's missing also. I agree. We should have that. A lot of things are missing in the game. Especially the scares, man. No scares at all. Until now, at least. It's been three hours. And I've heard that this game is not Wait so long. Wait a second. Guys, this is it. This is the machine shop. Holy crap. It is. Man, Chris, you really know how to find the coolest stuff. Totally. Nice work, Chris. Let's look around and see what we can find. Yes. Yeah. You really think we're gonna find anything the police miss? They're pretty thorough, right? They do miss, though. Look at that. The train? Yeah. Yeah, in the article, it's a skeleton crew now. We're all pulling triple duty. I'm the only one left who even knows how to work some of the machines. The rolling miller, the shears, the freight transfer system, said Frank Stone. If Frank was the only one left who knew how to use the freight transfer system, and that one still suspended. I bet it never got searched. Ooh. Not thoroughly. Ah, uh, good point. I doubt there's any bodies in there. There's no harm in looking, though, right? If it's even possible to get up there. Let's find a way. Come on. I love how they are all excited to die. There gotta be a way to get up there. Okay, we're high me now. Hi, Gerald. Press it. It should open the door, right? Maybe there's something useful in there. There's a key. Anything else? Okay. 
He did not even say that there's a key. I said that. See what Robert has found? Yeah, he's very resourceful. I agree. It's a generator. Uh, I haven't checked there. No trinkets here, right? It's fine. If no trinkets, we can progress. Broken? Looks like, yeah. Uh, let me take a look. <clears throat> hey, can I ask you something there? Uh, sure. How come you never asked me to work on your movie? Oh, uh, well, it's, it's Chris's movie. She decides who works on it. No, yeah, because he's I mean, jealous. You know, I'm like a huge horror guy, too. I could have been helping you right from the start. But it's not... That, that, that wasn't... Um, wasn't what? We're making a horror movie, yeah, but like... I don't know. The point was for me and my girlfriend and best friend to all do something together. Looks like a movie, yeah. Like just us so I'm just in the way man. you're spending a lot of time with my girlfriend <laughs> well both these options are really triggering look at that I want a few few minutes alone with Chris uh Let's go with the impatient one. All right, look, the truth is all night, I've been trying to get a few minutes alone to talk to Chris and it hasn't been easy. You're annoyed that Chris doesn't want to run off and make out with you in the lair of the man who nearly made me an orphan. That's not what I said. It's not my fault. She's more focused on her work than you, man. Give me a break. Oh God. What's up party people? Bunch is throwing soon. Uh, so that door over there needs power for it to open. Genius. Oh my I god. I saw a key in there. Think it could be useful? Could be, yeah. Generator working? Nah. Unfortunately, it's toast. I can get it working. Just need to scrounge up a few parts and it'll be good as new. Then let's go scrounging. Okay, we need two parts for the generator. This might work with the generator. Right, that's one. Hey, have I seen this somewhere? Hold on. Is this the screw that Augustine put on the table when we first saw her? Right? In the manor? Was it? I don't quite remember. Interesting. Okay. Let's find something else. Well, can I open this? Nope. We need to find some parts. How's the generator coming? Getting there. Could help with the generator. That looks brand new, bro. At least put some dirt on it so it looks old at least. I still believe that Quarry had better graphics than this. What do you think, guys? Well, probably because Quarry was set in a dark, dim, lit forest with a lot of werewolves, creatures. Also, Until Dawn Remake will have better graphics than this, for sure. Oh, wait, hold on. It's a quick time event. Uh, Feather. I'm just gonna call you Feathered. Is, is, is that okay? Welcome. Oh, sorry. I, I didn't see that. God. My bad. 
Or give me another chance, please. Please give me another chance. There we go. That's fine. That's actually good. It's fine. aim for that one yeah just aim for the one yeah it's fine oh my god we're not aiming for that one guys it's getting faster oh perfect Job. Thanks. Oof. Open the power door. Absolutely. Will do. Where's my flashlight, by the way? So we have power now. Can I climb this? Oh, I can climb this. I did not even check this one. So there's a key over here. I bet the key is inside, right guys? Yeah. That's it. Oh yeah. Now we're getting somewhere. Oh, going to push and pull more. Okay. Which door? That door is locked. Did you check it? All right. So the only way forward. <sighs> is this one, right? Climb. Oh my god. Okay. I can't see anything. I'm going straight in this hole. I'm scared, Can't man. I believe they got me crawling through the roof ducts like a raccoon. Speaking of raccoon, guys, I've heard there's a horror game called Chupacabra Hunt. I'm going to play it after this game. Okay. What have we here? How many do I need? Let me check. I got four, five, six, seven. Oh, I just need five more. In every generation, she finds people who work for her for free. Hmm. Maybe this key will open up the box cart. Can I open this from here at least? Thank you. Find anything? Yep. It's got a label on it. F Stone. Holy shit. You think? This mm. could be a real connection to Frank Stone. <sighs> oh, man. Mm. Nice. Let's go. Let's see if the key unlocks the box car. <sighs> Progress. Oh, we have to go up. I thought, what is, what is he looking for over there? Up. Still need to go up. Mm -hmm. Still, my favorite uh, super massive game is House of Ashes. That game is pure perfection, man. Everything is so good about that game. Move, kids. I'll jump. What happened? I'll go first. I will. 
I'll go first. Easy as one, two. Wait, wait, wait. Ah. <laughs> Three. Well, if it's that easy. Oh, Robert. Careful, Robert. Robert! I got, got you. you. Ooh. Ooh. Thanks, man. I got you. That would not have been a pleasant way to go. I would not have wanted to break it to your dad. That would be an even more unpleasant way to go. <laughs> Yo, check it. I got you, I got you. Wow. Right through the wall. Man. Let's see what it is. Is that a hand? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, shit. Damn. Is... Is that a... Yeah. And it's got friends. Oh, my God. This is insane. But what did you expect? Must have come loose when the freight broke through. In the layer of a serial killer, huh? Hmm. Open that. Let me see it. Okay, let's what read it. Other people. No want to get close. Feel every blow. Hear their screams. This time, make it last. Better control. For the next small cuts, keep clean. Taste their fear. It's on the page. A creator forced. Use what's at hand. No, not what. See at night. Inspire terror. Cut plus fix. To purge the work or worth, I don't know. Purge, purge the world, okay. I can read it in the right over there. Nice. Good book. Interesting. A hatch. This must be how Stone got in and out. Oh, if I examine that, that's gonna progress. I guess the cops never connected Frank Stone to this. No, I'm not reading all that. Okay. Uh, nothing else is here. A lot of... Ooh. Examine that. Ready? Oh, fuck! What is it? Oh. I knew it. Damn! I think she was one of Stone's victims. They never found her. They never found her. I don't think the police ever found this place. How do you know that? Because they went and just left all this stuff here. I'm sorry, man. I think I gotta go get my dad now. Good call. What? This is like real deal, no joke kind of shit, man. No, you can't get the sheriff now. I'm serious. We really shouldn't be in here anymore. Robert, back off, man. Just wait. Wait for what? Calm down. Chris, I know how important your movie is. But this whole place is part of an actual murder case now. It's ancient history. There's no statute of limitations on murder. Which means right now, we're tampering with evidence. You want to fuck with that? He's right. But the movie? The movie's done. I thought you... Robert's right. You should get the sheriff. We got what we need. Go. Just don't touch anything else, okay? Finish looking get around. The hell out of here. Uh, no trinket here, so I don't care about anything else. I'll just go. We gotta go. Wait, where's Linda and Bonnie? Completely forgot about them. We should wait outside uh, until Robert comes back. You can't move that. 
Is moving that such a good idea? Uh, do you think moving that's such a good idea? No way I'm not getting a shot of this thing. Yeah, but it's like evidence. Nobody can prove we knew that before we got the shot. Plausible deniability, man. I don't think that's what that means. Well, I won't tell if you don't. I think you're missing the point. This is the point. You've been like obsessed with making this movie all about Frank Stone ever since you heard about him. So? So it doesn't feel like it's our movie anymore. It feels like it's your movie. We're making this movie together. It doesn't feel like we're doing much together at all lately. Not just the two of us. Hi, May. Every time I turn around, there you are with Robert. There it is. I can't seem to get a second alone. We're alone now. Yeah. And all I can think about is you and Robert. Uh, you asked Linda to work on the movie with us. We needed help. And she's my friend. I wanted you guys to get to know each other. Well, sometimes it feels like I'm being ganged up on. That's not true. We're not ganging up on you. It's how I feel. Yeah, but it's not true. You don't get to tell me how I feel, man. Let's... I started going out with you because you were really fun and making this movie was really fun. Oh, here fun. we go. But this... This isn't very fun anymore. So... It's not you, it's... What are you saying? I'm saying if we're not having fun anymore, maybe we shouldn't be in a relationship anymore. Yeah, because relationship is always fun. That's how it's supposed to be, right? <laughs> okay, I'm not going to change your mind. Yeah, let's just let, let's just get on with it. I get the feeling this is less of a question and more of a statement. Well, I'm not gonna be able to change your mind, am I? Probably not. And that's it, huh? So we're breaking up. I've got to get this shot. Uh, bro. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Wow. Well, that hand is going to move. No way it will move, right? What's happening now? Oh? Oh? Guys? We just did break up. She said we're not having fun. <laughs> huh? What? I don't know. <laughs> oh, oh, okay, okay. I, I have my controller. I'm ready. What's happening now? What is that? Confront! Confront! Oh, I'm coming! Ah! What the? No!
Anything? Nothing. Not that I can see. I'm telling you, this door's a waste of time. Whatever's back there, it's important enough that she's put it behind this thing. I think the only way in is to solve it. There's an empty slot, so there must be a missing piece that fits here. Okay, let's say we all go hunting around this place for the missing cylinder tumbler thing. Can I go Even back? If we manage to find it. How do we solve the rest of it? Maybe there's something else in the atrium that's like a clue. Why would anyone put a clue for their massively complicated lock right out in the open? Practically right in front of it. Just a guess, but why not try this? No. Nope. <clears throat> I'll, I'll stay half an hour let's go it's fine we're good guys let's go up here see what what opened what doing good dimitri welcome back is there any trinkets here oh i got a key you know what they say about keys Gotta be a lock nearby. Yep. What's this? No one says that, Maddie. <laughs> That's a lot of dollar for an old movie. Movie review. Written by Augustine. No spoiler yeah i appreciate that it's fine I'll, I'll deal with the consequences myself i have not not performed really good in the previous games also i play new star wars games i heard that was a tragedy is it good i've seen a lot of clips about star wars outlaws oh it's not doesn't look good guys the gameplay and stuff something over there oh i already saw that so we found a key where will that go what was that oh that's Use item? Yes, sir. Got a key. Unlock it. Hmm. Something's missing. Okay. Find the missing piece. Have you seen the missing piece, buddy? Something this weird has to be important. Does it open? How? Oh. How will that open that? Can I get something from here that will open the other thing? I don't know. Let's go downstairs and find something. So we got two things that's missing a piece. Other hand should have other piece. What about this one? You're coming with me, buddy. Oh, okay, you are. So we put this here. Use item. Perfect. Alright, I got that. Some kind of hammer. 
I wonder if it's from the statue of that little dude. He's not little, but okay. Use item. Put One that there. One hillbilly and his hammer reunited. Boom. Ah! Exactly what okay, I needed. Okay, time to unlock that gate. Perfect. I found the key, guys. You can stop looking. What prize lies behind the mystery door? Do I even want to know? Oh, I know the code. Maybe it's a pattern, but I can't make heads or tails of it. It's the house. Or heads and the heads. The tree. And heads. Shut up, Madison. And the hammer. House tree hammer. Oh, that's the house. That's the tree. It's the hammer. Nice. Huh. That was not so bad. Interesting. Okay, I'll go first. Sure. Muted? Am I? No, I'm not. Welcome, Robert. Well, if you were hoping for some insight into how Augustine's mind works, I think you got your wish. Uh. Hooray. I don't know what I expected, but it wasn't this. Mm. Let's take a look around. Be careful. Oh, there's a trinket here. Where is it exactly? Oh, there. Easy. That one's easy, guys. Just four more. It's like a museum for... I have no fucking idea what. Something unearthly for sure. This whole place is like a film set. Nice. Hey, Linda. Check this out. I'm not reading all that. Resurrect Frank in 1980? I have no idea what was that. Was that Frank? Well, that's cheery. Anything else? Oh, dragon egg! Oh, Vagar must be in there. I am uh, speaking from the Trade Winds Movie Theater on Texas Avenue, where we have witnessed, are witnessing some sort of protest, or I don't know. Uh, all, all I am able to report at this point is there have been several attacks on the general public, as well as police and medical personnel. It's not overly clear, at least to us, what the uh, catalyst for the situation was but I can confirm that it started in the cinema itself as it has been reported an employee was stomped to death during a showing of Murder Mill uh, from here from here I can see considerable damage done all around us and police are currently doing their best to control this crowd okay okay oh no okay now now there is an arrest taking place and several people are moving in storming the officers at every side Oh my god. Oh! Oh my god! Okay, okay, that was an explosion. That was an explosion. I, I can't see. I can't, I can't see. Uh, oh my. Oh. The police have now opened fire. It, it now sounds like the police line has just broken. I, I can't see anything. I, oh my god! Oh god! Oh god! Holy shit. That escalated quickly. That reporter was like, 
Okay, okay. Everything's fine. Okay, oh my god. Okay, hold on. Before we go here, what if I open this first, which is locked? Now we can go here. This is... No way. No. Ghost camera. There's no way. It can't be. Hey, Linda. Hmm? You should really come see. What is this? It was just displayed here, open to this page. Talismans. Contain wells of great power. Can take many physical forms. Often manifest as keepsakes of past victims. Victims? Interesting. Keepsakes of past victims, which can become protective talismans for those who bear them. What do you think it means? I don't know. But it must be important to Augustine if it was left open on this page. Maybe it's... That's normal. Robert! It's Robert! It's Robert! I can see him! But I'll kick him anyways. Sheriff Green! Oh no, it's not Robert. It's Sheriff Green. He's alive. How is he still alive? Bro, how, how old is he? Is he like 80 years old? I think we should go retrieve the rest of the crew. It's like he doesn't even question anything they tell him anymore. I mean, he, he's a smart kid, but parents can be wrong. He's got to get that through his smiley little skull. Bonnie, he can't just be a little mama's boy forever. Bonnie. Huh? It's getting really cold. Maybe we should, you know, get the others head out. Oh, cold. Yeah. I got something for that. Pocket warmer. Okay, sure. Okay, sure. Thanks. Uh-oh. Oops, I guess I got colder than I thought when I was following you guys all the way out here. Nah. Sure. I know my limits. I've had to stay right up against them just to get through the past couple weeks at home. It can't be all bad to spend more time with your family. <laughs> Spoken like a true person who's not spent enough time with my family. I've spent a lot of time with Jaime. <sighs> Jaime's... I think that's Robert. Uh, he can yeah, be all right. But she says Sheriff he just Green needs to grow up. Sam Green. You've got to convince him to leave Cedar Hills when he graduates. He could come to New York anywhere. He just can't stay here. I don't know if Jaime's ever even imagined himself anywhere else. He doesn't think that far ahead. Well, even if he hasn't, you've got to. What, leave? Yeah. I mean, Unless there's some secret, unrequited reason why you might want to stick around. How's that your business? And how's that any of your business, Bonnie Rivera? <laughs> Look, if there's one single thing a small town like this has to offer, it's freshly squeezed gossip. Why do you hate Cedar Hill so much? You used to be like town mascot. Oh, that was when I thought the world began on Main Street, circled all the way around the Earth, and ended right back on Main Street. Once I moved to New York, I realized the real world starts on Canal Street, bounces back and forth between Avenue C and West Side Highway, and ends on 14th Street. Cedar Hills ain't even in the picture. How's it going with your band? I really want to see you play some shows. Oh, Dunzo broke down. Kaput. Oh, I'm sorry. 
it was all right. Bands, you know? I started a band to get girls, but I made the grave error of dating a girl in my own band. Oh? She was cool, but once she found out my trip back home was indefinite, she and the band pretty much moved on without me. You deserve better than that. Yeah. I think so, too. Maybe we should go find everybody else. Are you sure? I was just starting to warm up. Yeah, I'm sure. Because Linda is old? No, but Linda is still younger than Green here. Sam, I mean. Sam will be like almost 75, 80 years old there. Oh, there's a trinket here. Oh my god, okay. I'll Second get that my trinket. Mom comes home, it's lickety splits for this chica. Yeah, I got that lickety trinket, right? Splits, scrams, wham, bams, and Didn't I get it already? I'm still not sure I... I'm leaving Cedar Hills for good. Oh. I got this one already. Is that a bug? Can't say I blame you. Back to the city? Mm, where else am I gonna go? Well, there are other cities, you know. Nah, just the one. What are you gonna do there? Mm, same thing I always do. Make shit up, fuck shit up. Maybe make some movies. Oh, yeah? Mm, yeah, looks fun. Can be, yeah. Where'd you get that camera, anyway? Oh, well, it's not mine. I know, it's Jaime's. I asked you. Uh, we got it from a curiosity shop in town. Uh, probably the only one, then. Yeah. A lot of things has happened. Where did Chris go? Well, Jaime's in two pieces now. And, yeah. We're gonna end it right here, guys. We'll pick, up, pick it up tomorrow. Tomorrow will be a very exciting episode. Make sure to join in. Alright, I'll see you in the next one now. Till then, take care, bye-bye, have a great day, and keep on gaming.